Ladies, Ladies and gentlemen, and gentlemen welcome, welcome to, to breakfast. Today's event is going to be a race, race of skill, skill race of attrition, attrition. and will it be just a demolition derby? Get ready, get ready and be prepared, prepared for, for carnage. carnage. Let's, Let's get ready to rumble. rumble. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Dusty Roads Racing Wreckfest. Uh, today we have a three race event at Furwood Motor Center starting out with a short circuit uh, we're using the uh, Bulldog and all the cars are the same we're doing 10 laps and uh, let's see where got me starting Harrison Ford has the uh, the pole position and I'm all the way at the back. <laughs> all right then. <laughs> Let's go down trackside and start our engines. I don't want to be on the outside. Now, I have said that for a car like this on a short track, I don't like using all six gears, just four. But for a track like this, I will. And I've got 10 laps to get all the way up to the front. Had to get it right in my way, didn't you? <laughs> Is that really necessary? Get off me. But just because you don't know how to drive. Well, I'm back in 12. It's halfway up the field. I did go up and see 7th and 8th for a little bit. Harrison Ford is still in the lead. This is Mr. T that I'm fighting for 10th. Never mind. Up to the ninth now. Mr. T is right in front of me. I gotta pay attention to the track. Power down, come on. Lock him up going around that corner. Harrison Ford still in the lead. Jackie Chan is right in front of me. I'm in ninth. Kurt Russell's behind me in tenth. I'm in ninth. We're halfway through the race. 
Yes, please, wipe out more. Don't flip yourself, please. Now I'm an eighth. That's Jackie Chan right there in that green car. Ooh, how do I get that far out of line? <clears throat> oh no, what happened up here? Well, Bruce Willis is now in front of me. He's seventh. Now I'm an eighth. Whoa. I really don't want to be on the outside there. Dolph Lundgren right here. No, it's not Dolph Lundgren either. He's right in front of me. Ouch. Still an eighth after all that, and I just put somebody out of their misery. My door is open. Oh, Harrison Ford just came in the wood. He had the pole position, and he had the whole time. I'm in seventh with that pass. Bruce Lee is right in front of me. Come in right behind Bruce Lee. Uh, Burt Reynolds had the best lap. Wow. Harrison Ford had the pole, he had the win. All A classes up to seventh with me at the rear of that part. All right, let's go up to the booth and watch the replay. Sorry. I uh, come from the back and go all the way up to seventh. Everybody beating and banging, veering off. Ow, thanks, thank you for getting in the way. I thought it looked worse than that. Yeah, I really do like using the Bulldog. Is that really necessary? Really? At least I got back into my wheels. But Bulldog really is a lot of fun to drive.
wish it sounded better, more like a small block V8, but whatever. Yeah, a few dents and dings and scrapes. Nothing that won't pop out and buff out, so... At least it's not unrecognizable. I was getting myself into a lot of trouble trying to see who was right in front of me and behind me and the lead. That's why I kept going off the track. <laughs> Good thing that uh, rail is that far out, be hitting your rear end on it all the time. Okay. <sighs> it's called a bulldog, but it sounds like a bunch of bees in the ears. <sighs> I 
All right, and we'll be right back for the next event. Still at Furwood Motor Center. We're doing the rally circuit this time, and it's all troopers. Uh, let's see, Al Pacino has the pole position. And where do they, uh, 22nd. Okay, all right. Gee, I wish this was better randomized, but whatever. I've got 10 laps to get to the front. And we're all in troopers doing 10 laps. So let's go down to the track side and start our engines. Okay. I don't want to be at the outside for this turn. Try not to let the lead get too far ahead. There we go. Punch it. And just like that, I'm up to fifth. Oh, don't hit the barrier. Lap one, ladies and gentlemen, and I'm in third. Al Pacino is still in the lead. Michael J. Fox right in front of me. Kersel, Kurt Russell behind me. Come on. If I stay where I am, I'll have a podium finish. But will I be satisfied with that? No. Gotta go for it. Go for your dreams, don't just settle. Spun out Michael J. Fox on the turn. Now it's just me and Al Pacino. Sylvester Stallone's in third. Five seconds behind. Ooh! Wasn't expecting you to do that, Al. And that puts me in the lead for now. Just gotta keep my lines clean. Power down. John Connery is now in second, and he's seven seconds behind. Come on. Eight seconds behind, Al Pacino back in second.
Al Pacino and Sean Connery are really fighting for second. Uh, 11 seconds behind. Am I coming up on some lap cars? We're halfway through the race. Yep. Coming up on the last cars of the lap. <clears throat> Al Pacino back in second, nine seconds behind. Sean Connery and Al Pacino, I keep, I'm telling you, they are just going back and forth for second place. Coming up on some now coming up. About to start putting some people a lap down. Ooh. Don't flip it. Really not going to worry too much about putting people a lap down. As long as I don't get too tangled up in them. Because like I said, I got a 12 second lead over Sean Connery and Al Pacino. laps to go. Really? Okay, you're a lap down. Those cars are a lap down. Coming up on the final lap. White flag is out. White flag brought to you by Capital One Bank. Whoa, whoa, what was that? Al Pacino, Sean Connery, oh, they're like 15 seconds behind now. Coming across the finish line. Ooh. I came in first. Let's see. I didn't check last time to see if there were any DNFs.
and no DNFs this time but one two three four five six seven eight cars a lap down Arnold Schwarzenegger came in the very last that's terrible At least no DNFs. Okay, let's go up to the booth and watch the replay. The first six and a half minutes of it. Oops, gotta press start. Keep it together, man. Back and forth transitioning from gravel to tarmac to gravel to tarmac. Do I have a lead? Yeah, I think I have the lead at this point. Yeah. That last pass was for the lead.
try to keep my lines as clear as possible and from that angle it looks like I'm always like almost hitting that uh, barrier and I think I was <laughs> let's see There's the back, the back of the pack. It just looks like I'm about to hit that barrier from that one particular angle. And that's the race, okay. All right, so I came in first. That's another trophy. And I had the best lap too, sweet. All right. And we'll and we be right back, back for the, for the main, main event. event. At the Furwood Motor Center, the main circuit, full grid size of 24 cars. We're doing 20 laps. I'm using the bullet this time around. And at the pole position, we have Mel Gibson, followed by Clint Eastwood, Mr. T, Steven Seagal in fourth, Burt Reynolds, Mike Tyson, Harrison Ford, Tom Cruise, Sylvester Stallone, Al Pacino starting 10th. Bruce Willis, Michael J. Fox, Jackie Chan, Wesley Snipes, Jean-Claude Van Damme, Kurt Russell starting in 16th. Then Chuck Norris, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Dolph Lundgren, then me, Sean Connery, David Hasselhoff, Bruce Lee, and Hulk Hogan bring it up the rear. So let's go down trackside and start our engines for this final event. I'm on the outside. Don't want to get turned around like that. Or like that. Or like this one. Come on, what was that? That had to be blatant. We'll see it on the replay. I'm up to 13th right now. Why are you slamming on your brakes right before I go over this jump?
up to ninth. Mel Gibson still in the ouch in the lead. If I had any fillings in my teeth, they would have been all knocked out from that hit. Like that, I'm back at night. They go dive bombing right in the middle of the inside there. Trying to use me as a break, not gonna happen. Of the seventh, Mel Gibson's still in the lead. Sixteen seconds ahead. Well, I have. Enough time, don't hit the wall. I can't have enough time to catch up to him? Probably not. I'm at button six. Get out of the way. Yeah. Fifth. Bill Gibson's 15 seconds ahead. Doug Gibson still out in the lead. Steven Seagal right here in front of me. Sean Connery is six seconds behind me. DNF right there on the side of the road. That was a personal lap down.
Ugh. Why? Well, there you go. Yep. I'll lap down. That's all I'm dealing with right now are lap cars. Kurt Russell's two seconds ahead of me. He's in fourth, I'm in fifth. I don't know who that was. Now I'm in fourth. That must have been Kurt Russell, I guess. Bruce Willis is now in the lead. Eight seconds ahead. Ugh, I knew that. Is that going to teach you not to hit your brakes before you go over a jump? And we're at the halfway point. It's an official race. I'm up in fourth. Can I get a pole position? I mean, there I go again. Pole position, no. Uh, podium finish, thank you. Don't push me into the wall. That was Kurt Russell that passed me, pushing me back in fifth. Somebody got spun out right there, puts me back in the fourth. For Russell's in third. Bruce Willis is in first. Mel Gibson must be in second. Mel Gibson's in third now. He's like a couple seconds ahead of me. That wasn't that far that I just passed. That car still left down. Do I have a front end left? Mel Gibson must be that truck right there. Yep, that was Bruce Wood, I mean, <clears throat> Mel Gibson, fighting for third.
Sorry, no Gibson. Terrible. But he was in my way. Up and up and third. Bruce Willis is 16 second, 17 seconds ahead. That was oh, oh. <clears throat> somebody a lap down because Kurt Russell is right up here. Need to be on the inside part. That puts me in second. Bruce Willis, 15 seconds ahead of me. There we go. Finally, a good line around that turn. I think that's one of my front wheels. Knocked out of alignment. Bruce Willis is 13 seconds ahead, <clears throat> and we're going into the final lap. White flag brought to you by Capital One Bank. Slam on the brakes out there. Bruce Willis won. Uh, 13 second margin. Oh no. Because Kurt Russell was four seconds behind me when I crossed the line. <sighs> but he had the less, the best lap. I almost had the best lap. Bruce Willis came in f uh, first with me, then D Kurt Russell, Mel Gibson, then Steven Seagal came in fifth. Clint Eastwood, Sean Connery, Mr. T, Tom Cruise, Wesley Snipes rounds out the top ten. Then Sylvester Stallone, Dolph Lundgren, half the field was a lap down. 
then Michael J. Fox, Mike Tyson, Chuck Norris, David Hasselhoff, Burt Reynolds, Hulk Hogan, Al Pacino, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Jean-Claude Van Damme was two laps down with Bruce Lee, Harrison Ford, and Jackie Chan DNF'd. He was the only DNF. <sighs> All right, let's go up to the booth and watch the replay. It was almost a tragedy right there at the end. Right there, right there. Knock out both my taillights. Really? You realize I have to drive home in that thing? Yeah, I knew my front end wouldn't look too good after that. I didn't notice my door was open. I know my hood was popped.
Too bad the recording doesn't go all the way to the end. Why, wow, smack the uh, rail right there, right before the start finish line. Pow! That was hard enough. Alright, so that's it for today's video. Next weekend we'll be going to Eagles Peak Motor Park. It's a strange double tri-oval. And we have a demolition derby at the beginning of that. So I will see you next, trackside next time.